You're into the fourth round of a major for the first time in your career. What's been behind this run so far? Uh, it's been an amazing experience for last week. So first time that I've won back-to-back uh, -back, uh, matches in a slam. And uh, I'm very exci excited to play Nadal tomorrow. And uh, I played three great matches here, didn't drop a set. And I feel that uh, I have a lot of confidence, and uh, which I will obviously need for tomorrow. So I am looking forward to tomorrow's match. My first three matches were like I had a lot of supporters, like Serbian supporters and a uh, few guys that were cheering every point. So this was like I never had this before that they were also singing songs and everything and uh, cheering my name. So that was really exciting and uh, kept me going. Like I had a lot of uh, a lot of energy just having them there. Have you done anything different in your game this last week? Uh, no, but uh, it feels like everything uh, fits together this week. And uh, I mean, I came to Paris, practiced a few days, didn't actually feel the best like some of the previous weeks. But um, I just stepped on the court first round, played amazing match against Delbonis. And uh, since since then, it just keep coming. You play Nadal tomorrow. What kind of strategy are you bringing into the match? Yeah, well, uh, I watch many of his matches, some on TV, some live. and. Uh, He's definitely gonna be the toughest opponent I ever played till now. I mean, he lost only one match here, so there's not much to tell. You have to bring your A game and hope that you can um, hurt him somehow and uh, with the right tactics, try to, to give your best and uh, to go out on the court to, to play to win. But uh, of course, this is gonna be the toughest part because we all know how much confidence he has here and uh, the way he plays is just amazing and uh, it's the biggest challenge for me. And your countryman Novak Djokovic has beaten him this year on clay and almost beat him here at Roland Garros last year. Have you talked to him at all and asked him for advice? Yeah, well, I said uh, said it before. I asked him for uh, for uh, advice, and uh, obviously he can give me advices and stuff. But at the end, I'm the only one who has to go out on the court and play. So uh, I'll try to have some uh, some advices in my mind when I'm on the court, but. Uh, at the end, it's going to be difficult for me, and I'll try to 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 remember everything what uh, what I'm thinking before the match and preparing tactics for tomorrow.